Hello, my dear. We are going to talk about such an important topic, which is your morning. Yes. The day starts with a charge in the morning. How do you start your morning? The alarm rings. What is your first reaction? Do you immediately open your eyes up? My lord, I have overslept. Or you lie, stretch, and say, Another day, good morning, goddess. Or you immediately jump up and run to the kitchen to prepare to send your children to school so that you are not late for work. Or you wake up and think, my lord, I have not slept at all. Another day, I cannot wait for the day off. What do you think? Do you know that your day depends on your first thoughts? This is the first reaction. A new day will pass the way you meet it. So I would recommend you start every morning with a good positive mood. Charge yourself up with energy and power. The alarm has rung. Do not rush to immediately get up. If the sound of your alarm is too sharp and you do not like it, turn on your favorite track you can wake up to. Maybe you write down these words. The alarm rings and you hear the following words. Good morning, beauty. Good morning, goddess. Another day is coming. Wake up. Is the goddess waking up? Wouldn't you rather wake up to that? Let's try. Perhaps your morning will become bright, deep, and colorful. After your alarm rings, do not rush to get up. Make a sweet stretch like a wild kitty. Feel your body waking up. You feel your arms, legs, your spine. You are bending, and only then you are getting up. After you get up, you approach the mirror. I can hear your objections. My lord, wrinkles on my face are so ugly. My lord, what a wrinkled face. What baggy skin under my eyes. No. Do not say this. Instead, approach and say, looking into your bottomless eyes, Good morning. Good morning, beautiful. Try doing this. Conduct such an experiment. And then tell me how your day is. Put a glass of water near you in the evening. We are women, and water is our element. Soft and flowing, and like a waterfall somewhere, very rash. That is why we need to drink no less than two liters of water every day. How much water do you drink? Less? then you must quickly catch up. So, you have a glass of water. Water has a unique ability to read our minds. Every wish we make near water will come true, because our body consists of 70, 80 percent water, and this amount decreases with age. We charge our magical water with better energy than we want to. Put the glass on your right palm and cover it with the left one. Fill your glass up. Whisper what you want to wish yourself in it. Health, love, prosperity, success in work, love with your partner. Send all of it there. After you whisper to this water, start sipping this water with pleasure. This is the secret. Do you drink it? And this water that you have charged becomes your life. You start radiating this energy of joy, inspiration, excitement, and the pleasure of life. There appears a field of charm around you. People want to help you. You are becoming a talisman for your family. After you sit this water, 
Proceed to a special breathing exercise. Let your breath be very light and free. Feel your pulse. Feel your pulse on your hand or your neck and start breathing. Let's take a very deep breath before this. As if you drop all the sleep off. Then start breathing after seven pulse beats. Count the beats. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Breathe in after seven pulses and out after another seven beats. Perform seven cycles of this exercise. One cycle consists of one respiration. Only then open your eyes and look at the world like a woman who has woken up. Who has awoken, your energy is ready for a new day, new victories, new discoveries, to a new realization of your predestination, and to help your lineage. Now you are ready to meet a new day. When you come to my workshop, I will show you a special energy ritual of awakening. The ritual of Queen Nefertiti that she used all her life and never aged. You will master it at the workshop. If you have not realized it yet, we conducted all today's ritual to special music of youth. It is called Taj Mahal music. It is a symbol of youth and love. If you still do not have this music, write to me and I will tell you with pleasure about how to perform exercises to it and what special energy does it convey. See you soon. The strength of the living a shaman drum calls you to the places of power, trance practices, contacts with other civilizations, and communication with spirits will all await you at the next seminar. Be the power. Be one with the power.